Hey, not sure where to look. Oh, happy Saturday. I've already had quite a full day already. Went and got a latte and went to see a couple of the wee rabbits and my parents. Um, because those wee rabbits were had spent the night there. So we had some fun, played outside. It's a really beautiful day today. Although now it's kind of overcast and it has rained. Um, but still really beautiful, really quite mild tempered outside so it's very nice so here we are ready for day four go ahead and open that Ooh, another speckly one it's very pretty I love these little bits of pinky purple. It's very pretty. This might be a favorite. Oh, I love that. And again, this is the Lay Family Yarns Countdown to Christmas. Christmas. Not Christmas. Countdown to Easter box. Oh, I love it. Um... I did not get much work done on my sock yesterday. I devoted my time after work to sewing. So I only got like a couple rounds in of that. And then we were watching a movie last night and I heard Alfie making this like choking and chewing and swallowing noise. And I was like, what? And I turned around and he had one of my things of yarn Part of it was down the hatch already, and let's just say I had to, I don't know why I'm telling you this, I, but I had to rescue the yarn, and part of it ended up in the garbage because <sighs> you. So, have a cat, they said. It'll be fun, they said. But, um, yeah, so he's fine. Don't worry about him, but... Oh, little stinker. So since this bag is kind of open top, I think he can like smell wool because he can tell if there's yarn in a bag. So I think he must just be able to smell the wool. Um, so I had to put it up because otherwise he can totally get into this little bag. Oh, that little stinker. So I did want to show you, I got the yarn in for um, a test knit I'm going to be doing of a really nice cardigan. Um, so this is not, I don't know if it's quite showing up. The light in the background there isn't good. I'm going to block it with my head. It's really pretty. So the yarn is Barocco, or Barocco, not sure how you say that, Mochi. And the color is green tea, I think. Mm, it doesn't say just has a number it's color 3208 but I'm pretty sure it was called green tea or green tea heather but can you see the different colors speckled in there isn't that so fun and it's so actually I wonder if seeing it in this light would be better it's so soft and it's got a real halo to it um it is 37% baby alpaca, 35% nylon, 26% fine merino wool, and 2% other fiber, whatever that means. Um, probably means the hair of whoever was working at the yarn factory, because we all know that our hair ends up in whatever project we're making. Um, So I'm really excited about this. This is a worsted weight yarn and that is what the pattern calls for. So I'm really excited to see how this is going to knit up. Um, but it'll just be a nice cozy cardi. So um, that's that. I'm really excited about that. I got this from um, lovecrafts.com. That's where I got that. And then did I have anything else to show? Oh, well, my dress. This is one of my um liberty shift dresses that i made the first one i made of course so it is 
daisy fabric. The fabric is just like a cotton quilting fabric from Joanne Fabrics. And I used some little daisy buttons on the cuffs. And the only mistake I made was I put the cuffs on backwards, like the buttons are to the inside, and I'm pretty sure they're supposed to be to the outside. So, well, I mean, the cuffs are on, right? I just put the buttonhole on the wrong side, essentially. But it's fine. I kind of, I don't know. I don't hate it. and No one's going to notice. So, but yeah, I'm really happy with it. Um, I could insert some twirling footage so that you can see how it looks overall um but then yeah the dress I was working on last night I have it very nearly finished I've got the sleeves put in I just need to do like the second row of stitching and then trim the seam and then just the hem and then the buttonholes and buttons I don't know what buttons I'm gonna use for it I'll have to dig through my stash I've got quite a lot of buttons um, because my great grandma gave me her button collection before she passed. Um, so that's a treasure for sure. Lots of fun ones in there. Um, so yeah, have a fun rummage through those and pick out what to put on there. Uh, so I'm planning to finish that dress today. Might make myself a cup of something decaf and then just get cracking on that. So I've got a little, um, get together tonight. So I may just go ahead and post this video before that though, because I don't know, it'd be awkward to pull out my camera and start filming there, but we'll see. So um, yeah, if I don't talk to you later today, I will see you tomorrow, Lord willing. So see ya.